Sounds like there's a heck of a lot of work going off the pitch at the minute under Danny Schofield. He's less than two months in charge at the minute. How have you found his work and, and what he's brought to things and how he's changed things up? Exactly that. Um, you know, as he's mentioned many times, you know, and likewise for myself, very process driven. So we enjoy the work through the week, and as footballers, that's what you want. You don't want to be sort of. Um, sort of not not improving on day to day. Um, this week's been difficult with the weather, but um, although the, the distraction of the weather, we've worked immensely hard. We found some some great coverage on, on, on the wet, what we wanted to see in, in sort of the, the analysis side of it, and been presented really well from the coaches and then as players we've took on into training sessions and implemented some some things for the game so it's, it's been a, a really hard working week as always um, and now it's a case of fine tuning towards the end of the week ready as we prepare for the game on, on Saturday. Have you kind of done more more classroom based stuff if you want to put it that way rather than on the pitch this week or have you kind of all mucked in and managed to get things cleared and, and done plenty of stuff on the grass? No, it's been difficult. Obviously, you know, it's getting the timings right that we approach the training sessions because when's the right time to go out and get the work in? But, you know, we, we always stick to a, a routine, um, which helps us because players are, you know, driven by that in terms of their planning and preparation. We have to be ready to go into training. So the analysis comes every day for us. It's part of our sort of product now. We don't, we don't change that side and it's comes two or three times a day to us so in different areas small doses which we can we can absorb and take into the training session and um, yeah it's been working really well so we don't really change it from that standpoint we'll change timings around you know the weather permits and things like that but yeah the analysis side of our game is something that we've obviously really structured really um, for the different units that we have and it's, it's uh, paying off at the moment. You're only a few points off the playoff places again. You've been in and around it all season. I mean, you were part of that League Two promotion side six years ago, it will be. Do you feel that the squad that you've currently got is, is capable of, of coming close to what that squad achieved or might that need a little bit more in January or something else? I think it's hard to compare squads um, because of times. You know, it was a good six years ago that um, and football's changed a lot since then and the more teams now at this level um, that are competing now I think it's been a, it's a difficult league first and foremost football's changed slightly in terms of there's more progressive football teams at this level than they were then and, and I think obviously players that are around the club right now that was the end produce if you want of, um, of a build phase and although it was probably at the beginning of it when I first came in we were alone and then they, they went down um, we needed time to adapt to different players coming in and there was a lot more players who would come in and transitioned and now I look at this squad and it's and it's an, obviously new manager and new, new coaching staff but the players will come um, as they are every day we'll, we'll always work to what we know and I think it's a case of, of getting the value from this squad that we can and um, obviously right now we're nowhere where we want to be we want to be a lot higher up and we will work to that um, but yeah it's hard to compare them squads both enjoyable times for me because first time I was sort of around sort of a lot younger which was first foremost better but um, definitely now with my sort of being the eldest of the team it's a different look for me to help the younger lads um, along as well the journey that I was often getting at the time as well so yeah, I think we've got a lot of work to do to sort of get back to where we want to be in terms of these days, but that only comes down to sort of performances and results and we know that and we'll take care of them first and then hopefully that, that'll put us in a good position.